Hello, it's Holly with Ivy Cole Creations, and today we are working on Christie's Beautiful Life Series 10, Sketch 9. And this was created by Janessa Franco, and she has this lovely two strips with um, like three clusters, a large one on the side and one on the top, one on the bottom. And I wanted to use this funky 70s roller rink type style paper and I love it. It's from the Hip Kit Club but I didn't know what to do with it. I love this sun-kissed polka dot paper and I decided that I would use it together to create this layout. Now I thought by putting the the purple paper behind the polka dots it would give it a bit more dimension and layer and really after I put the after I put the photos on you can barely see any of it so it didn't really matter um, doing it but I wanted these photos um, documented because they are pictures of my daughter doing cosmic bowling so it's black light and and um, glow-in-the-dark balls and stuff like that and so I went through my figures and I found this um, this iridescent silver um, set and I'm just doing some some uh, surgery here on the thickers to get an S out of an ampersand and I often do that, especially if uh, I only need like one letter fixed. And so my title is Cosmic Bowling, and I just placed it across the bottom. I didn't want to create a cluster where my title was, just because it was very low at the bottom, and I felt like it would take away from it, it would take away from the actual thickers and that beautiful iridescence. Now, when I have little scraps, I often punch them out just in circles or hexagons, just so that when I have a, when I have a layout that calls for them, I have them on hand. And so what I did was I went through my circles and I pulled a bunch that I thought would work and then I just stuck them all over the place because I wanted them, well I wanted the two clusters, definitely. Um, I was debating on a third, but there wasn't enough space and I didn't want to, I didn't want to add it down in the bottom. So this large one just became a, my journaling spot and where I clustered everything around. Um, so I really, I used the circles because I had the polka dots on the paper, but also were bowling, so I thought that would be cool, you know, um, use the circles as to represent the bowling balls. And that's why we ended up with a bunch of circles all over the place. Um, I just added journaling lines, and then I wanted it to look a bit more on purpose and scattered so what I did was I took enamel dots and I placed them all over my clusters. I did use the enamel dots to create a tiny cluster at the bottom um, by my title just so that it kind of finished off that visual triangle and I just used the pink, the blue, and the magenta that are in the paper and I think it matched really good. The playlist for everyone who's playing along with Christie's Beautiful Life Series 10 will be down below, along with each person who is featured for the day. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I would love to hear from you.